This is a demonstration of tying an ascot. Obviously, a large ascot is least or expensive, and the short ascot is the most expensive. Less is more. And so I'm going to demonstrate the large one first to show you how exactly it is worn and how to keep it actually on your neck without problems. Obviously, this is the inside. This is the outside by the tag inside. You want to put that tag in the center of your the back of your neck, bringing the left side lower than the right side because you're going to wrap the left around the right once. You'll wrap the left around the right twice. You'll wrap the left around the right three times. And three times, because it's so long, I want to make my knot tight so that I could adjust it properly. And then I'll bring it through. And once bringing it through, I have my ascot properly in place. Once I adjust it up, I can now button my shirt. Once I button my shirt, I want to make sure that the top button is unbuttoned, the second button is buttoned, and so on and so forth. That's how you tie an ascot without looking in a mirror, without even having any type of guidelines other than that. I'll demonstrate to you, obviously, how to untie it the same way you tied it, just bring it back through, bring it out of your shirt, and it's untied. Now this is my demonstration to show you that less is more. Obviously, this ascot actually cost a fraction of this one. This is a very expensive ascot. The reason why is because number one, it's reversible. You can wear it on either side. And I'm going to demonstrate it on the side that I did not show you to prove my point. I'll wrap this one once. I'll wrap it if I can find it again. And I'll bring it through. Once bringing it through, it's going to sit very closely to my chest. I'll put it in that second button, and that is a superior ascot. That's my demonstration of how to tie an ascot. Really, really simple, but it's an elegant piece of man's material or man article to wear. And that's the end of my demonstration. I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks. Next.